Well, hello there. My name is sometimes Heather and I play Elsko Zola. Last time, I started to explore the Clockwork City with a relatively new character. Today, I'd like to share my first impressions on her class. Here comes that stroke of luck. I play ESO with multiple characters. Most of them are sorcerers and nightblades. Lately, I've felt the need to explore classes unfamiliar to me, even those I'm a bit afraid of. Templar has been the class I've avoided the longest time. I see them as lawful good kind of characters and, well, I'm neutral. I felt that Templars are bound by strict rules that tie them to the light side of the world. Even USP says, they wield the powers of light and the burning sun to smite the wicked or to heal and support the wounded. I have a tendency to inflict my characters with the curse of vampirism, so you'll probably understand why Templars intimidate me so. Still, I created Annuel to see how the class works. After all, even the sun has a dark side. As I first made Annuel, I figured she might be a healer with a destructive streak. I leveled up her skills when I felt like it, which happened quite rarely. My prejudice was strong, even after I'd chosen the darkest morphs for her abilities and clad her in black robes. Everything about her was sunny and bright. Good, somehow. It took me forever to get her past level 50. Usually this is a fun moment for me. I get to start thinking about champion gear and monster sets and mythic items, but with Amuel, I didn't feel the joy. She was still a stranger to me, bright-eyed and so, so eager to save. I wanted to destroy her to push her far beyond the limits of good and evil, paint her with the darkest shade of black. I forced her to kneel before Mother LeMay and now, well, now I'm actually kind of interested to see where she'll take me. Yeah. I've chosen to take her to the Clockwork City to show you her progress and to push myself to play with her some more. Though she still feels unfamiliar to me, I'm eager to see how the Dark Gift plays with Templar skills. I think I'll turn her into a damage dealer. It's easier to play solo with a DD. Healers, though they can use powerful destructive magic as well, aren't that well known to me. Combining two areas I know little about would make things too difficult. I honestly don't know where this journey will take Annuel and me. I'm quite certain I'll make a lot of mistakes with her initial build, and I'm even more certain that turning her into a vampire was the biggest mistake of all. Though I didn't enjoy playing with her in the beginning, I'm slowly changing my mind about her. The dreaded day star casts shadows, and in those shadows, darkness can strive. Perhaps I'll find that darkness with Annuel. I do hope our journey will be an entertaining one. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye.